Okay, good morning. It's another video. Another video. The first video of the day. I hope you're right. I hope things have been productive. I hope you've been good. But maybe things haven't been so great. Maybe today has been a really unproductive day and you've actually been procrastinating all day. You've been procrastinating everything that you wanted to do today. You've not done a single thing. Don't worry. I was exactly like you two. I used to procrastinate everything. I never ever revised properly for like my exams. But I'm going to show you a secret that I learned from being on self-improvement for almost two years now. How I managed to finally stop procrastinating. So stick to the end because there's a lot more to this than what it seems. And it's by something known as Parkinson's Law. My name is Wada and I help other young men like me take back control of their lives. So what Parkinson's law is, is basically work will fill the time allocated to it. So basically, if you have like a one month project, which is what I used to have a lot for like, because I did uh, photography and like art for my A-levels, we got a lot of like very long three month projects. If you have a one month project, your work ethic will be spread out throughout that whole month because you know that you have a lot of time to do it. So you'll do some work some days, you'll be like, oh wait, I know I've got a month, so I'll spread it to another couple other days. And then when it gets up to the 12 hours before that it that project is due, you suddenly start doing loads of it. You start actually doing like a bunch of that project because the time that's now allocated to it is only 12 hours. So your work fills up that time so you actually do the work it's why we have we cram revise anyone who's done an exam has probably cram revised 12 hours before an exam and knows how much it sucks even though you have three months to revise for this exam you're told three months earlier and parkinson's law is why we end up cram revising the work will fill out the time that's allocated to it so if you have three months You'll do a couple of days of revision here and there throughout that whole month, but not a lot because you know you have a lot of time. And this is procrastinating. So how do we stop? How do we prevent ourselves to stop getting into that position where we have to cram revise 12 hours before the exam? Because that doesn't work. It's stressful and you don't pass. It's, it just doesn't work. It's not a good idea. But why do we keep doing it? And how can we stop? If the problem is the deadline, how much time you're given to actually do it. Set your own deadline. Literally, sit down and just force yourself, if I don't do this tomorrow, like, I failed. Like, the deadline is tomorrow. Even though it may not be. Even though that, that homework may be due in three days or in a week's time. Just tell yourself to sit down right now and that your deadline is tomorrow. Ignore the school's deadline. Your deadline is tomorrow. And fact is, maybe your homework is actually due tomorrow. But it doesn't matter, you're going to sit down and literally force yourself, my deadline is tomorrow. And in reality, when you actually sit down and do it, it's not going to take you 12 hours. It's only going to take you a couple of hours to actually do it. Maybe even less than that. And the thing is, this works with everything, like cleaning your room. I, my deadline is tomorrow. I have to clean my room by tomorrow. I'm going to sit down and do it now. It's like those days where you've accidentally done your homework. So where you... You're there, you've done it again, you've procrastinated 12 hours before your homework is due, you, your homework's due tomorrow. You start cramming, getting it all done, staying up late to get it finished, and then you get it finished, you go to school, and then you find out that the homework's due in three days, and it wasn't actually due today. But then you have this weight off your shoulders. You've done your homework. People come to you and ask for you for advice on the homework because they're cram revising it. You did it. And you feel good, you have this weight off your shoulders and you tell yourself, why don't I do this all the time? Why don't you? Set yourself your own deadline. I have to do this task by tomorrow. If you're not subscribed to me, then there's a chance that you probably will never find this channel again. But if you do after this, or if you already are, another video will pop up in the corner and you should 100% click on this because this could definitely help you just like this video has. Stay consistent and do the best you can. You know what time it is? I think we all know what time it is. Self-improvement gifts.